Hello and welcome to another YouTube channel. Why do I always say YouTube channel? I'm gonna do that again. Hello and welcome to another YouTube video with myself, Charlene Smith. It's match day. The Premier League is back. Do you know what? We have had football on, but it just feels like it's been so long since we've had any Premier League action. Obviously, I've been watching England. I've been watching the Arsenal women. Uh, but that feeling of, you know, the title race uh, with our Arsenal men has just felt like it's just been like so far. But um, yeah, as in, well, let me make that make sense. So far as in like we ain't been like having that feeling for some time. But uh, yeah, I'm excited. I'm so happy the Premier League is back. Listen, as it stands, while I'm doing this video right now, Man City are currently playing Liverpool. As it stands, it is 1-1. So Liverpool got the first goal. Man City managed to equalise. But I am keeping an eye on that game because, listen, I know we got Liverpool next week here, yeah, but I really want Liverpool to get something from this game today. So obviously, Man City could drop points. And uh, yeah, and then we'll sort them out next week. We'll sort Liverpool out next week. But yeah, I am keeping uh, an eye on that game. But back to our game. We're at the Emirates Stadium today where we are facing Leeds United. And I'm going to be at the game today. I'm excited. I'm going to be at the game watching and supporting the team. And listen, I know I always say this, but i got a good feeling about it today. But to be fair, I've had a good feeling for like most of the games this season and we haven't really lost many so you know <laughs> my feelings are right but yeah real talk though um I feel like we are going to get a win today obviously I don't ever want to underestimate any team regardless of their league position the form they're on where they're at but I am staying focused on us now it's obviously a big blow that William Saliba is not going to be fit for this game so he ain't going to be featuring I do hope he gets well soon. Wishing you a well recovery, uh, Saliba. So we have got Rob Holden who will be stepping in. And Rob, in the last game before the international break, you did have a good performance. Yeah. So I want to see that again today. All right. Nothing crazy. <laughs> but um, yeah, with uh, Leeds, listen, they're sitting in 14th place as it stands. But they're only three points off 20th place. Like, that's mad. Like, it is so tight at the bottom of that Premier League table. Um, and, yeah, I'm just so excited. I'm happy I'm going to the Emirates to watch the team. And I'm happy we're going to get three points today. Listen, the starting eleven ain't out yet because it is a bit early. But I'm going to give you a score prediction now. I'm going, my gut instinct, yeah, this is what it's saying to me. Ideally, I do want a clean sheet, but my score prediction for today's game is 3-1 Arsenal. All right, that is my score prediction. I'll, I'll give an... I'll, I'll re, no, I'm not going to revise it. I'm sticking with the 3-1. That is my first fault, so that's what I'm going with. 3-1 to the Gooners, but uh, I'll let you know how I'm feeling about the starting eleven. Uh, I think it pretty much picks itself. I think it'd be similar to the team we played against Crystal Palace before the international break. Um, but yeah, I'm happy that the Premier League is back. And once that starting eleven is out, I will let you know how I'm feeling then. So yeah, I'm going to start making my way to the Emirates Stadium. I'll speak to you Welcome guys. Welcome to the game. Look who I'm with. What's going on? I'm good. How are you, Sonny? Yeah, you feeling excited about today's game? Yeah, I am. Yeah. Good to know that Leeds might be missing three key players, so yeah, it gives us a better fighting chance. Um, but let's hope that we can do us a favour before and uh, we can uh, have a bigger, bigger lead by the end of the weekend. Exactly, we are actually keeping uh, our eyes on that Liverpool game, which is currently 2-1 to Man City as it stands. 3-1! Oh, someone just told us it's now 3-1. Mate, Liverpool need to sort it out. But uh, back to our game, you've got a score prediction for today. 3-2 um, 3-2, yeah But um, 
Yeah, if, I've, I've got to worry we might concede, but if we don't concede, then I can see us going away with a 3 0. Yeah. But otherwise, if we do concede, then we might, we might concede. Yeah, we've so, got no Saliba as well, who's that injured. Well, Holding's done a good job, so the only thing holding us to do is just make sure he doesn't get caught. He needs to hold it down today. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going for a 3 1 Arsenal win. I, I did want a clean sheet. I do feel like we'll score three goals, but I'm going 3 1 Gooners. Let's go! Thank you very much. Head down at the Emirates. Listen, I'm super excited. Lineup still ain't out yet. Uh, as you guys know, I'm an early bird. I like to get here nice and early. But everyone seems to be in good spirits today. Spoke to a couple fans. People are quite optimistic about us getting three points. You guys know I am too. But yeah, just about to go into the stadium. But yeah, I'm sticking with my score prediction. 3-1 Gooners. Let's get it, baby. My hair's been blown away, bro. But we inside. Let's go. Right, I'm inside the stadium and I've seen the starting 11, which I'm happy with. I'm happy with that nice, strong start. And I'm happy to see that Saka isn't starting as well because he's been playing so many minutes and I do get a little bit concerned, you know, about his well-being and him just getting burnt out. So I'm happy to see that Saka is on the bench. Uh, I do feel like we're starting with enough strength to get the job done and I'm sticking with my 3-1 Arsenal win but yes I'm excited and Jesus is starting as well, Trossard, hey, listen I think we might even score more goals than that because we got players that can score goals out there but yeah let's see how this first half goes, let's go Gooners! <laughs> Now, Arsenal currently sit at the top of the Premier League table, but how many league matches have we won in the last six games? Is it three? 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 Is it three?
No, it might just be a lucky day.
in the corner. Give it, give it, give it, give it. Oh, go on, Gabby! 
Corinthians, Gabriel Jesus.
come up to me. So do you guys remember the times when I was getting baited, yeah? This is what I'm known for, being baited. This is the young gentleman that's done it. <laughs> do you know, he's actually just come up to me and said, I've got something to confess. I'm going to come up to you as a man and just tell you, I've been baiting you. So guys, all the entertainment you've been getting, this this is the culprit. Not just me, not just other people as well. Other people Do you know well. what? I'm not, I can't give you not credit yet because the way you not right then, like you just fall for it. You just read it as normal. So this is the the AFTV beta. That's what we're gonna call no, no, you. Not just me. Not AFTV just me. beta. Me that does it. It's a lot of people. A lot of people. Listen, you it. have kept so many people entertained, yeah. and some of the things you guys come out with, I'm like, nah, it takes I'm a genius. Like, board, how do you do it? Yeah. <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> And a lot of time on your hands. Nah, literally, yeah, like, yeah, like, so do you wanna uh, tell us what what you baited us with? <laughs> AFTV beta. I think he got me twice. Yeah, he got me twice, yeah, got me twice mate. Yeah. There's like a whole like YouTube yeah. thing going on with my baits. <laughs> But obviously, it hasn't been recent. At least he's been honest, like, eh? Like, I think around lockdown, I'm like... Yeah, that's when I was known yeah, yeah, for just yeah. being baited. I can't believe I found my baiter! Not just me, not just me. <laughs> well, one of them! I'm intrigued to find out who the rest are. <laughs> this is jokes. But do you know what? Big respect to you for actually coming up and saying, Charlene, I've been baiting you, yeah? <laughs> that is jokes. Be interviewed by... What's your name, mate? DJ Wale, listen, he's got his whole setup going on. Yo, check him out, BJ Wale, it's going down. 4 1 win, baby, you know how we roll. <laughs> anyway, let's get this interview under at the Emirates Stadium. 4 1 to the Gooners. Listen, I am so happy with that result. Three points. So we remain eight points clear of Man City because they did get that 4-1. Uh, Was it 4-1? Yeah, they got a 4-1 win over Liverpool. Um, but yeah, I'm just so happy. Listen, my thoughts on today's performance. I think the first half, we weren't that great. I'll be so real. Um, we weren't okay, but we just gave Leeds a lot of time to create opportunities. They was getting a lot of joy over um, on that on our right hand side, I think we were missing Saka if I'm completely honest, um, because I just love the way like Ben White and Saka link up and just make things happen. And I think we were sort of missing that in the first half. Um, but the second half we came out, Ben White got that early goal, second half, yeah. And I think that sort of set the tone for that half of the game. And we were just a completely different team. You can see we really wanted it. We really worked for it. And we managed to score three more goals, as well as conceding one. But yeah, managed to get that all important 4-1 win. But yeah, I say our performance was a lot better in the second half. It was great when we saw Saka come on as well. But all in all, I am happy with today's performance. I'm obviously happy with the result. Three points, three very, very important points. But yeah, man, we remain top of the league. Eight points clear on Man City. It is the final countdown. Nine more games to go. I've got so much faith and belief in this amazing team. Like I've been saying, like I continue to say, we are winning the Premier League this season. No, I can't lie, yeah, I'm absolutely buzzing. But yeah, great result. But guys, listen, I hope you've enjoyed watching today's vlog. Um, yeah, obviously a great experience being at the stadium, supporting the team and everything. Um, but let me know, how did you guys find the game? What's your thoughts? How are you feeling? How excited are you feeling as well? that the Premier League is back. I can't lie, man, I've missed it. Like when I got in the stadium and I see the players coming out, warming up, I was just like, yes, the Prem is back. Exciting times. Like I just felt that, that good energy, you know? <laughs> Although I have that most of the time, you know how I am. But yeah, man, that feeling is just, it's a special feeling, but I'm just so proud of the team and just, Everything that we're doing this season is just so amazing. But let me know how you guys are feeling in the comments below. I'm Charlene Smith. 
I'm signing out from the Emirates Stadium and you guys know I'll be back very soon with another one. Bye for now. Love to you all. Three points in the bag today, baby. Nine games to go. We're lifting that Premier League trophy. Let's get it.